Hey there, Shirtlight here. Remember the Gundam vs Gundam Next Plus Unlock Guide? Well, you seem to have enjoyed that one, so I'm doing this one for its prequel, Gundam vs Gundam. Now, some of you probably know that I'm not a fan of that one since it is heavily lacking in a lot of departments and basically Next Plus had to pick up and fix what it fumbled. Nonetheless, it could be a me thing, so for those who just want the four unlockable mobile suits, I made this guide. So, enough bitching on my part and let's get to the topic at hand. There are four unlockable units. The RX-77-2 gun cannon, the MS-18E camphor, the RX-78GPO-1 Zephrantes and its full burner variant and finally the ZGMF X42S Destiny Gundam. Now like with the next plus guide, you can turn down the CPU difficulty for the arcade mode while turning up damage, boost gauge and the timer. And if you want to make the arcade runs a true game journalist experience, pick the Freedom Gunner. It is one of the few in-game units with a proper attack cancel, the input being square plus cross and it has directional variance. Also on top of that, if you are waiting for the attack cancel to reload, you can still cancel the special melee input regardless of any other factor. Anyways. You can get the gun cannon if you beat the arcade mode once. If you beat it twice, you get the camphor from the AT war in the pocket. And you get the Gundam GP1 by beating it three times. You still gotta do it one more time to get the Destiny Gundam though. Well, that should cover the unlocks. I'll go work on more projects, so for the time being, you have a good one. Shirt lad, signing out.